Alrighty, NT8 on the porch. Just wanted to give out a video response to uh, my buddy down in Australia, Bandit Nev. He put up a video the other day asking, uh, has the Cold War restarted? And he's thanking Putin, Russia, the United States. He didn't cover North Korea, but yeah, anyway, Putin came out and said, well, we've got these new undetectable missiles that will be able to get by the United States' uh, anti-ballistic missile threats, our shoot-down ability. Really? Really? Your economy is lower than France? And somehow you amazingly came up with the money to create this? And so, of course, mainstream media had to blow it all out of proportion and blame it on Trump, you know, because, you know, Trump's not doing anything. But he's spending $700 billion on the military over the next two years. Amazing how that subject comes up. So mainstream media is trying to beat Trump up over that. And yeah, it goes worldwide. North Korea, they don't even talk about anymore with their missile threat. Because flat out and simple, if Russia, China, North Korea or anybody else fires a nuke at the U.S., and even if it happens to land, it's called mutually assured destruction. We've got... We've got nuclear missile submarines all over the world. You know what it takes to reprogram a missile to, instead of go to Pyongyang or North Korea, you probably have to push like three buttons, get an authentication code, punch in three more buttons, and now it's aimed at Moscow? Simply amazing. And then to aim it at Beijing, it's probably pretty much the same situation. We've got all that shit targeted. It's not a big deal. I just scoff at all this bullshit that, oh yeah. <coughs> yeah, Trump. Trump doesn't know that Putin's got these new invisible missiles. Really? Really? With the third largest economy behind France? Where are they getting the money to do this? Remember how we, how Ronald Reagan destroyed them? He outstripped them. He built more ships, more missiles, more goddamn everything. And they couldn't keep up, so Gorbachev said, fuck it, I give up. Don't believe this hysteria that mainstream media is trying to throw in your face. Because it's simply not true. Alright, NT8 on the porch. We'll talk to you later.